It's the Live Music Showcase from WMNF in Tampa. Hey, guys, I'm Bill Dudley, and uh, today on the show, we got a couple of brothers who are just going to play some red-hot, scratchy, old, bluesy-type music and other kinds of things that seem to all fit in. Ben Prestige and Brother John Prestige are here live in the studio, and uh, we're streaming live on Facebook. If you want to check us out live, go to Facebook, LMS, WMNF are the magic letters. Anyway, let's let him start off with a tune. What's it going to be? It's going to be Bad News is the name of the tune. Yeah. All right. That's a bad song. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do a good one for you next. Okay. <laughs> That's Ben Prestige and uh, John Prestige. There you are, guests here on the Live Music Showcase today. Now, Ben, we've been seeing you for years and years at the Florida Folk Festival yes, uh, sir. in May up in White Springs. And uh, I didn't know you had a brother. Yeah, that's my only brother. Have you always had it? That's what our mom said. That's it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, since I was about five, he's five years younger than me, so. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Well, that's great. Where do you guys make your home? Live over near Vero Beach now, near the kind of near Wabasso area. Oh, west. okay. You're, so yeah. you're in Florida. Still in Florida. Yes, yep. sir. Yeah. Are you? Were you from here originally? Yep, from around Okeechobee, between Okeechobee and Indian Town. I didn't know that. Florida crackers. I yep. never knew. I never knew much about y'all. Well, we'll try to find. We'll try to find out some more information about you guys this uh, the, during the hour here. Yeah. Uh, 
So how long have you yourself been picking and singing like this in yeah. this style, I should say? Man, I've been playing blues and fingerstyle guitar and slide guitar. Um, I started trying to teach myself when I was probably about 14 or 15. Before that, I played uh, trumpet in school when I was like 10. That's how I got into music. Trumpet, wow. Yeah. And, uh, hey, we didn't bring that. Can we put a mic? Can we get another mic in here to get the trumpet out? It's in the van. I'll be right back. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so uh, started on trumpet. And then, uh, yeah, when I was, you know, 14, 15, started teaching myself guitar. And I uh, heard actually Roy Bookminder doing finger style. Yeah. So I was doing blues. And, Pretty influential uh, guy, that Roy. Oh, uh, definitely. So I really got into finger style and stuff after that. So, yeah, he's yeah. Good so, dude. so you you have some you have people that you that you are have influenced you besides Roy. I mean, like old older recordings and stuff like that. Oh yeah, I love old like Booker White and uh, Freddie McDowell stuff for slide. I'm playing the slide on this thing now. I don't know if if you're on Facebook Live. Uh, well, I was just going to say that. Uh, I was just going to say uh, if you go to Facebook Live, you can see uh, uh, Ben's instrument, which is a homemade uh, guitar. The neck is from a, a real guitar, but the the rest of it is uh, looks like a roast pan. Yeah, it's an old roasting pan, and uh, it's got some sink drains in here for the sink sound, drains for sound, the sound holes. holes. And it's got a little resonator thing on here. It's just kind of an old strainer colander. <laughs> so. Well, it works great. But yeah. yeah, for this old blue stuff, yeah, Freddie McDowell and uh, Book of White and stuff like that, I really love some of them old pickers. Do us another yeah. tune. Yeah, we'll do it. I'm going to do a couple gospel tunes. Can I do two in a row here? Yeah, sure. Do two in a row, yeah. Shout out to my dad for making that guitar. Yeah, my dad made this one here. Yeah, we'll talk about that some more, too. Let's go to church here.
John Prestige, there are Good. guests here on today's live music showcase from WMNF in Tampa. You can watch the show live right now as it's happening at Facebook. Go to Facebook, put in LMS WMNF. Later on this evening, our uh, YouTube producer, Richard Stone, will be editing this show for YouTube. We have our very own channel that uh, Richard has set up, and you can watch it on YouTube just go to YouTube, put in WMNF885FM. That'll get you there. And you can watch all of our old shows going back years. We got some killer shows, including this one. Yeah, <laughs> and you can, they're all right there on YouTube. But uh, if you're watching us live on Facebook, be sure to give us a like and or two. And uh, also, if you love this show, you might want to contribute to WMNF, which you can do by giving us a call right now at 813-238-8001. Support WMNF. Al alternately, you can go to WMNF.org. Check out the tip jar. You can do the same thing right there. So, Richard and John. B and Ben. Remember, I'm, I'm <laughs> shit. Sorry. Uh, That's all right, Bill. Push the button there. <laughs> so, anyway, <laughs> Ben and John. <laughs> um you saying you said you did a couple of gospel tunes just now, and do you do them at home? I mean, you you play in churches and stuff occasionally. I have played in church before. Yeah, when you're growing up, maybe. Yeah, some a little. Yeah. Yeah. Mostly now. Because uh, you know, years ago I made an album for some uh, uh, an African American church called the House of God, where oh, they yeah. use the pedal or not pedal steel, but the uh, lap steel guitar as their main instrument. The sacred steel. Certainly. Sacred, sacred steel. steel, yeah. It's wonderful. Yeah, I recorded the very first one of those working for a guy here in Florida. Nice. And uh, uh, it sounded a lot like that, you know, where you're doing a combination of slide <laughs> and regular picking. Yeah, yeah. And uh, that was great. Those guys are awesome. They are. They're, and, and, that, and that slide guitar was loud. <laughs> Is it loud? We can turn it down a little bit. No, no, no. I mean in the church. Oh, okay, good. In the church. It was oh, loud. Good. It was loud as hell. And, and people were dancing around, and it was just <laughs> great. <laughs> you, can't, you can't tell them, though, that it was loud as hell because uh, 
they might get mad at you. Yeah, I know, but it you was You can say loud. it's loud, though. It was very loud. <laughs> <laughs> I was there. <laughs> all right, all right. It was pretty exciting. It was pretty exciting. Oh, man, I love that music. Yeah, yeah. So if you just tuned in, we've got, uh, we've got Ben and John, Ben Prestige, John Prestige. And uh, Ben uh, uh, has been playing the uh, guitar made out of a uh, roasting pan and some other uh, uh, household items. And uh, John is playing the bass. Yep. Five string bass. You like five strings better than four? Yeah, I like. Yeah, I can get more notes. <laughs> yeah. So what's what's your story there, John? Um, he about three years ago invited me along to start playing music with him. I guess he got tired of being a one man band. He waited three years. I mean, until three years ago. <laughs> yeah, I was up in Orlando, just kind of doing my own thing. I was in some bands and stuff up there. You pick and sing also? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I've been writing a lot too lately. So now, do you do you do mostly blues like old blues stuff like this? I'm, or? A, I'm a country man. I like the old country? country music, old stuff. Yeah. So we kind of mix Classic it Classic country. We that's that's my favorite. call it now. Yes, sir. All right. Well, do us another song. All right, let's do that. Case, in case y'all don't know, too, he's playing foot drums. He's playing snare drum with your feet. I Hit forgot it, to mention I, that. I thought we were going to get to it. I thought that was who Matt was. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, Richard, right? Richard, <laughs> Richard. Yeah. That's who Richard is. <laughs> so he's playing snare drum. He's got a double snare drum here. He has got two hit, snare drums. And then he's got a tom, a floor tom. A hi hat and a, and a, and a kick, kick drum. Hi hat and a kick. And then I'm playing a little, a hi hat and a ride cymbal. Yeah. So you each are playing drums. Yeah, we got a full drum kit between us that we play with our feet. It's so. just all spread out on the floor. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> with uh, duct tape and bungee cords. That's great. <laughs> the wing and a prayer. All right, let me hear that A, John. We'll get place blues. Mention old Freddie McDowell, he did this one here. Classic Mississippi blues tune. Here we go. Well, I 
help if you will the law Help build this state And that day You would not worry my life Anymore You wouldn't worry my life anymore at Just going to leave him hanging on that note all there. Right, all right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Live music showcase here from WMNF in Tampa with Ben Prestige, brother John Prestige on the big bass. Yeah, you can just call us the Prestige Brothers. Prestige Brothers. We, we just put out our first album together about six months ago. I was just going to ask you about yeah, that. Yes, yeah, sir. Tell me about your, your stuff. Um, well, that album in particular, we have accordion, fiddle, uh, uh, literally tons of instruments, drums, uh, bass, guitars, electric guitars, dobros, uh, lap steels. And Ben and I played every instrument on it. We wrote almost every song on there. There's, I think, 14 tracks. And um, we recorded it all ourselves. It's all do-it-yourself. Do we did everything ourselves. DIY we prestige. Make right. our own instruments, write our own songs, and try to you know, get out there and play them to you nice people out there in, yeah, in yeah. Florida. Where can people come and hear you guys uh, play live? Any place uh, coming up? There? Yes, tonight, actually, in St. Pete, Florida, at one of my favorite places, the Ale and Witch. I don't know if I'm allowed to say their name. No, no, you, you, just, <laughs> okay. you can't tell them how much it costs, but you can say their name and what time it is and all that good stuff. The Ale and the Witch. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, it's a great place. <laughs> yeah, they got great beer. It's right there in St. Pete, so come on down. Where, where is that located? Downtown St. Pete. Okay. Yeah. And we're gonna have uh, we're gonna bust out the banjo and fiddle there tonight, but for radio purposes, we didn't want to be switching up too much. So yeah. Too much dead air. Yeah. So, so uh, where else? Any other places coming up? Uh, yeah. Highlands Hammock State Park coming up next week. Oh, down there in Highlands Hammock. It's yeah. a beautiful spot. Oh, yeah. it's a great park, and uh, they do a concert series there. It'll be there, I believe it's Saturday, but you can find it on their website or. You guys on our do website some too. traveling around, huh? Yes, oh sir. yeah. Yeah. I played. I toured all over the world. My, me and my brother have been all over the country, so. That's great. He's been in Middle East, uh, Africa, Europe, all over Europe. Well, all how over do the they States. react to this kind of music over there? It's good in Europe. <laughs> they, they like it. They like it a lot. Do um, they know more about it than we do? That's kind. Of, yeah, I've always heard that. Yeah, like the the real fans and stuff. They go to the festival and stuff. Definitely, they study it. Some of the guys will be like, "Oh, you played that Freddie McDowell song, but he did it on the Our Hooli Records in '60." But it was and after that they went out to lunch and they Chris had Chris Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> he, yeah, he knew exactly everything that, about it. The guy who recorded it, his cousin, was related to so and so. Yeah, those kind of guys. <laughs> They're great over there, though, man. Well, yeah. we got the Prestige Brothers here live in the studio at WMNF. You can watch us on Facebook, LMS, WMNF, the magic word. Type that in. I'd like to uh, shout out uh, thanks to all the great folks who are putting this show on for your listening and dancing pleasure. Mark Perfetti, behind the controls, assisted today by Yumiko Thomas. We've got uh, on the TV end of things, Bob Hoke directs this whole shebang. Okay. We've got our uh, camera people today, Marcy and Tom Connors and Bill Brain. Uh, Richard Stone is our YouTube producer. And holding the whole thing together in the control room here at WMNF, Steve Arduango, our show producer. If you want to yeah. get in touch with him during the show, send him an email, dj at wmnf.org, or call him at 813-239-9663. And uh, questions, comments, whatever. Uh, once again, that's DJ at WMNF.org for Steve. So, let's have another song. I've been doing enough it. talking here. Let's do it. You got, you got your electric guitar here. Yeah, my friend Bo Taigi made that from North Dakota. i got to give a shout-out to him. That's he a homemade electric guitar. He, he made it out of He lives in North Dakota. They were tearing down a barn up there, and he salvaged some of the wood and made a guitar for me out of it. It's an old 100-year-old barn wood there. Oh, I like and that. He's got the Okeechobee license plate representing on there. <laughs> Yeah. Right, let's do some original stuff, yeah. Gotcha. We'll do, we'll do Ramble first. Okay. Out. Yeah. This one's called Ramble. It's about, about, a, it's about the hurricanes hitting, so I know y'all can relate to that. I'm a no. Good round and round, I'm round and 
in a square ounce, square like Randall's underwear, but I don't care. She'll cook a supper at six. Fish, grits, and biscuits, quarter past the hour, you all. Did it miss it? You miss it like the point of this song. If you didn't miss the point, then you listen here, bro. Like the point of my now, point of my ten. Never single one of us is living in sin. It's a sin that I don't want what you want. Sometimes it's a sin not to want what you don't want. The Lord of whisper in my ears, he's got a plan for the beggar, for me, and for the business. Man, we can't for some time. Ways I was selfish, wishing I was fishing on the beach, on the sea, just lying in a pool and a bottle. Let me fill a five-gallon bucket, catfish, and find a drink of gin by the gallon of my. I get the words to that? Yeah. <laughs> Are they written down anywhere? Yeah, you can sing along with us tonight. I, you know. I want to learn that song. <laughs> All right. <laughs> hey, we heard from uh, we heard from South Florida here. Uh, some of your friends down in uh, in Avon Park uh, sent us a little. Uh, message. I think I know who that Keith is. Keith and Ginger yeah, down there. And the right, right. And, uh, yeah, and the they, they say enjoyed seeing these guys grow up around my kids down in Indian Town. No finer young men, and hardly any is accomplished. We'll be seeing them in Highlands Hammock. State Park early in November. That's right. Yeah. We'll see you there too. Bentley's. Hi, Hi Keith and Ginger. <laughs> <laughs> you got fans all over the world then. Yeah. Now, is there a website or something where people can. Uh, it's uh, Prestige Brothers on Facebook or you can go to benprestigemusic.com. Still okay. need to get that switched over, but it's uh, right now it's benprestigemusic.com. And we want to spell Prestige P R E S T A G E. Spelled like pre stage. Yeah, pre stage. Okay, got it. Stage. Yeah, that's a good way to remember it. <laughs> Well, Ben and John, the Prestige Brothers, are our guests here on the Live Music Showcase from WMNF. Thanks for having us, by the way. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. we need to thank uh, D Drum, located and made right here in Tampa, for donating the drum kit that we use sometimes on the live music studio. Whenever we have a rock and roll band, they often play our D Drums, and you can find out more about them. Thanks for that, and you can find out more about them at ddrum.com. And uh, you're tuned in to WMNF Tampa, listener-sponsored, non-commercial community radio for the Bay Area. If you love this show, you might want to donate. You might want to check out the tip jar at WMNF.org. Makes it really easy. Just tell them your contribution is for the live music showcase. Heck yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's good cause. So, so when you're traveling around the world playing and picking and singing like that, do people come up and, and ask you, you know, why are you doing that or anything like that? Do they, they want to know who you guys are and 
why are you doing this? Or how yeah. you got started and those kind of questions. That's all we can do. <laughs> <laughs> we need to put, yeah, no. Yeah, um, man, I love playing music and blues and stuff. And uh, the one-man band thing kind of just evolved over time. Well, I was going to ask you. you know? I was going to. I was going to ask you that about the drums and stuff like that. You know, because a lot of people can tend to just sit in the stool and play the guitars and stuff. But now you've got a whole drum drum kit. Yeah, well, I used to play and I'd stomp my foot on the ground and just you know playing blues. So you yeah. got that foot stomp going. Yeah. And um, the house I had that I was living at when I was when I was doing that, I had uh, wood floors there. That's good. And so you could hear the thump, and then I'd play live, and you couldn't hear it um, as much. And I was like, man, I'm kind of missing that sound. So I built a little wooden box and stuck a microphone in there, mm -hmm. and I would have that little thump sound going. But it, it kind of sounded like that. It was kind of thin. And eventually I started bringing a kick drum out to get a fuller sound. He's then, even, folks, he's even got a little extension on his kick drum pedal. His kick drum's like a foot away from where his foot is, so that he's got a, <laughs> so he can get his other drums in his uh, snare drum in that's, the uh, in the milk right. in the milk crate. Yeah, and how it evolved. So I had my my kick here with my uh, right foot, and then with my left foot, I was doing the hi hat. So that evolved into that, and then I eventually put the uh, snare drum on there. Um, and I kind of got the idea for this. There's old guys like Dr. Isaiah Ross. He recorded on Sun Records uh, before, I believe, before Johnny Cash and them guys were on there. Um, Dr. Ross was doing one-man band thing. And then there was a guy touring around Richard Johnston that uh, he was doing it around 2000, 2001. Mm -hmm. He was touring around doing a similar thing. with. Yeah, people have done stuff like this. Of course, everybody has their own way of doing it. Exactly, yeah. And, and mine evolved. Um, the reason my kick drum so far away, you're talking about that, is because with my right foot, um, if I lean my foot, if you can see it on Facebook Live, my right foot, um, if I lean it this way, I got a kick drum. If I go, lean it to the, my right foot leans to the left, I got a snare drum, or I can do them both at the same time. If oh, my you, foot got, a, you got a dual purpose thing going on there. So that's just with my right foot. And, and you then, can do both with the same foot. With the same foot. And then my left foot has a snare and hi-hat. And so, I, or I can get, <laughs> yeah, know. and the tom. And then I got a tom with my left foot as well if I move yeah, it forward. So floor tom. Yeah, so my, my right foot and my left foot are, are moving back and forth and sideways all the time while I'm playing. So. Boy. Uh, so looks like pretty, <laughs> got to be pretty coordinated to be in this band, folks. We only brought half our gear here, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll have it all to tonight. It Let's have another tune. All right, we'll do another original song here. Is this on your new album? Oh, this is on one of our older albums. I'll tell you what, our greatest hits album. You know what? Let's do one off our new album. Let's do let's do. Uh, Pistol. Right. It's a pretty heavy song, though. You gotta listen to the lyrics on this one. Keep 
Getting burned is only equipped with two cheeks to turn. Turn the other cheek, who seems a bit absurd when the cries of a child is being abused or overheard. Violence will and violence, all the peace you sure prefer. Christ's disciples carry swords. I read it in the word. How the prayer for peace on the inside. Show love and mercy on the outside. Song must fade out, huh? <laughs> <laughs> but you don't. But it's when you when you can't come up with an ending, you just do the fade out. There. Well, yeah, it's what they used to do a lot back in the. Back I, in the I like day. them old albums that did that. They did that it a lot a, back then. Hardly ever do it now. You know? No, got to pick up a copy of our new album. Yeah, we, we got a few fades well, on okay, there. Okay, then. And a listener <laughs> called wants to know how to do that. How do you how do you get the where do you where do you find the? How albums do you fade getting? out? You just um, no no. I mean, no, I'm, I'm just joking. Find the I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, we got them on our website, benpressagemusic.com. You can look on cdbaby.com. Um, Facebook has a link to it. You can get them at our shows is the, the best spot. To That's get the them. best place to yeah, get them, for sure. Yeah, no, that's tonight or tomorrow night? Tonight. Right? Tonight at the uh, the Ale and the Witch. In St. Pete. Yeah. yeah. Okay, good. That's a good spot. I think they got 6,000 beers on tap, if I'm not mistaken. Well, that's... I probably am mistaken, but it's close I, to it. Don't think I drink all of them. <laughs> you only have to have one or two. They're we, delicious. <laughs> we got Ben and John. Ben and Prestige yes, and John Prestige, the Prestige Brothers. That's right. And uh, Prestige is spelled P-R-E-S-T-A-G-E, pre-stage. Sure, sure having a good time up in here, I'll tell you that much. Yeah. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, nice we're happy studio. to have him here on the Live it's Music Showcase Friday. from WMNF. Mark Perfetti is mixing it today, assisted by Yumiko Thomas. Bob Hoke directs the TV portion, which you can watch. Facebook right now, LMS WMNF, what to type in there. Tell your friends. We've got Marcy and Tom Connors and Bill Brame on the camera. Steve Ooh. Arduengo produces this here radio show. <laughs> and uh, Richard Stone produces the YouTube portion, which you can watch later on this evening. And that is youtube.com slash WMNF885FM. Right. Makes sense, doesn't it? Makes perfect sense. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that homemade guitar, why did you put the license plate on there? I didn't, the dude that made it. Put it on there, but, <laughs> but, uh, he called me up and asked me yeah. for a license plate, and Ben actually got that old Okeechobee license plate to put on the front of my drums, mm -hmm. but then I just gave it to him to put on the guitar. It's our, it's our pit guard. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Works great. Well, you wouldn't want to scratch up that really good wood there. No, we try to keep all our stuff in uh, in a beautiful condition. You mint, all stuff's in mint condition, as you can see. It matches our uh, beautiful right. faces. I, I've, I've been on this show now for, we've been on for about 40 minutes, and I'm still working on reading all the stuff that's on that 
kick drum. <laughs> He's got more decals and things on that kick drum than probably uh, most Volkswagen Beetle uh, <laughs> microbuses from 1968. That drum's been all over the world. That's, oh, that's another AS88.5. I think I, I had a WMNF sticker on. Well, here we'll give you a new one. Yeah, but I got, I, we got to do something because I got the Flagler College Radio 88.5 on here right now. Yeah, so they're, they're up another in uh, St. Augustine. Uh -huh. yeah. So we'll have to get another 88.5 to stick right next to it. Well, you can do a new tune or an old tune. Yeah, what do you think? Um, you gonna do you gonna do that one where, where I sing on there? Yeah, let's do it. You can do uh, some. I'm not gonna sing. <laughs> how many how many more songs do you want us to do? Because we'll play here um, all all night until about we gotta leave here about seven because we gotta make the Illinois. <laughs> <wish, but. laughs> well, we got about we got, we got about fifteen minutes to go. We can squeeze in seven or eight at least. I wonder. Uh, that's wonderful. I like it. Let's do. Uh, we don't. I think public radio doesn't have enough um, moonshine songs. So. <laughs> What's, What's this? What's this one called? White Lightning. Because you can do the harmonies on it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Chobie, don't you? No. Alligator milk. <laughs> 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 Who did that originally? Is that Buck Owens did that? George Jones. George the Jones. Possum. Okay, I should have known. The possum. Yeah. 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 Well, we got Ben and John, the Prestige Brothers, here live in the studio at WMNF. 
Tampa. Yes, this sir. is a show that we do every week, the Live Music Showcase. Yes, and sir. you can see them live tonight in St. Pete at the Ellen Witch. And you go down, go on down to Highlands Hammock. When's that, when's that show? Um, next weekend, right? Saturday. Yeah, next, next Saturday. Saturday, yeah. Okay, and... Uh, I think you can camp out and stuff there, too. Yeah, okay. it's a nice place. Yeah, walk around <laughs> on the trails there. they got all kinds of stuff down there. I think it's BYOB and... Uh, Especially uh, now, it's a nice. little cooler, too. It's oh, yeah. real nice. We did it last year. It was, yeah, it's they had, great. They yeah. had bonfires and everything going. Great so. turnout. It's beautiful. Well, I hope you'll, beautiful be back at, hope you'll be back at the Folk Festival. Yeah, I think so, yeah. In May. I love that fest. Yeah. Oh, man, I wouldn't miss it. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Ben uh, has been one of the headliners for many, many years and because uh, they recognize uh, local local talent, Well, which is a really good thing. <laughs> they do recognize local talent, and they still let us play. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, so we got, uh, we got the Prestige Brothers on the show today, Mark Perfetti mixing it up, assisted by Yumiko Thomas. We got our TV crew, Bob Hoke, Marcy and Tom Connors, Bill Brain. Richard Stone, Steve Arduango, our show producer, and let's have another song. We'll do another original here. This one's called My Baby's a Weed Head.
the true story. True story. <laughs> <laughs> ben Thank Prestige, John Prestige, the brothers here on yeah, our thanks. live music showcase here from WMNF in Tampa. I'm Bill Dudley. It's a show that happens every Friday afternoon right here. Oh, he's picking up a different kind of yeah. guitar. This one actually is made out of a cigar box. He's got it's a cigar box with some kind of strange neck on it that looks like Br- two broomsticks. broomsticks. Are they broomsticks? They're uh, wooden dowels. Wooden dowels? We, yeah, we're not, yeah. We, we, we wanted to do, be, make it really professional. Uh-huh. So we put wooden but dowels. That is, a real guitar, that is a real cigar box there you got on the body of the thing. Yes, yes sir. I'll, I'll tell you about it. A uh, buddy of mine in Memphis, Tennessee named John Lowe, L-O-W-E from Memphis, Tennessee, makes these out of a cigar. Uh, if you're out there on the computer, you'll be able to see it. And... Uh, or you're watching in the future, maybe on YouTube. I don't uh-huh. know. It's yeah, kind of yeah, crazy. Either one, yeah. Somebody's probably seeing me on the f- in the future right now. In the future, <laughs> on YouTube. Yeah, right now. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. But this is a cigar box for the body, two broom handles for the neck that are held together with a radiator hose clamp, and the pickups are made out of sewing bobbins from a sewing machine wrapped with copper wire with a little magnet dropped in the middle. And there's two outputs because there's one bass guitar string and three guitar strings. So there's two outputs, <clears throat> so they go to two separate amplifiers. And no frets. And no frets. That's the way you like it. No frets. <laughs> yeah, so we play, we'll play slide on this one. So I'm going to play some, uh, so I'll do the bass and the rhythm on this song. My brother's going to do the uh, guitar parts. And if you get done with this one and we're still on, just keep on going, okay? Sounds folks good. on uh, Folks on Facebook will see yeah. the whole thing, YouTube. So come on out tonight, too. We'll have the banjo out, the cigar box fiddle out. We'll have a bunch of other instruments. We do a lot of old-timey stuff, too. So. That's great. This is a song I wrote called I'm Tough. It's tongue-in-cheek. Is that bass loud enough? It's loud enough out in radio. Yeah. Brother John's gonna pick, start out on the guitar and we'll bring in that cigar box. Well, the doctor went to slam me, but I wouldn't cry. So mama cleaned me up with boiling water and lie. But if the scratchy burlap blanket wasn't enough, I'll tell you right away that they named the boy a tough and I'm tough. Stuff too. Spend all of his days with the rheumatoid food. How the phony feels from sundown to sun up with no horse and no mules. He was like me, tough and well tough. Get rough. 